what it isn't Looking for a better way to get up out of bed Instead of getting on the internet and checking a new hippie Get up, first shot, come strut walking Little bit of humble, a little bit of cautious Somewhere between like Rocky and Cosby's for the game Nope, nope, we all can't copy up Bad, moonwalking, and this here is our party My posse's been on Broadway And we did it all way, chrome music I shed my skin and put my bones into everything I record to it And yeah, I'm on, let that stage light go <laughs> well, first afternoon. Only took three hours standing up. <laughs> nah, very happy. Um, thanks to Aiden for bringing us out here. It's been great. Um, still got five more days to go, so hopefully we get some more and get back one as well. And yeah, thanks very much. No worries, mate. Pleasure. Five days. You want to take your hat down to the survey there and start busking to pay for all the stags you're going to shoot? <laughs> Morning. Day two, North East hunting gear. Spotted safari tour. Woke up to a nice black coffee. Couple of pancakes. Foot massage. It's been about... 15 or 20 minutes this morning, glassing maybe six or 700 deer. Spotted one or two that's taken our fancy, might go for a bit of a walk. <laughs> Another 15, 20 minutes in the toilet. <laughs> Venison spaghetti, four toilet rolls later. <laughs> Highly recommended. Get into it. <laughs> yeah, we'll go out and see what we can get, eh? <laughs> Day two of the northeast hunting gear chill adventure up here with Aiden. Um, Dodsy got a ripper of a stag probably 24 hours ago, not too far from here. And um, yeah, Aiden spotted this one from probably a good 600 plus yards, I'd say, maybe more. And it just saw the glimpse of a little antler and put us onto him and closed the gap. And he stood up for us and did all the right things, and we decided to take him. So. Absolutely stoked at my first chittle. Thanks to Aiden and Matt. Um, yeah, spotted safaris and North East hunting gear. Get amongst it. <laughs> Pleasure, mate. No no worries. Worries. I can sing it, Mark. Ha <laughs> 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 
Country and deer. <laughs> I want to feel that you want it I want to feel by the morning I want to feel that you want it Oh, let me feel what you are Can you go take one? Take one, action. <laughs> um, day four and a half up here with Aiden, spotted safaris. Um, we made the decision, we'd seen this guy a couple of days ago. Aiden had been watching him for a week or two weeks or something like that, watching him grow and had pinpointed it might be one that we'd be interested in. Um, we got a quick little glimpse of him the other day. Um, he sort of got spooked by cattle and then just sort of stood up and there we were and off he went. Um, so we got up this morning and had a bit of a glass around home to see if there's any new stags that have moved in. Um, and then the, the decision was made that those guys probably wouldn't move too far. So we came back down um, to where we'd seen this guy last, or where Aiden knew he was sort of poking around. With a bit of anticipation, hoping we'd see him again. And um, we walked everywhere sort of where we'd seen him, where I thought we were going to possibly be able to cross paths with him and wasn't there. And I was probably thinking about a sausage and bread for breakfast. And, then all of a sudden Aiden, Aiden said that he spotted something and we had a bit of a look and yeah he was about 180 yards out and waited for 45 minutes or so for him to stand up and had a good rest and everything was there and took the shot and he, he didn't go real far and yeah so haven't measured him yet but we're probably reckon high 29 something like that um, late though but perfect exactly sort of what I wanted so massive thank you to Aiden um, it's been an absolute blast up here the last couple of days um, and Dodsey from North East Hunting Gear because he sort of, he basically organised the trip. I just had to pay me money and come along so um, yeah, I'd highly re recommend it to anyone who was chasing Chittle. Up here it's perfect, you can get well looked after, 
um, yeah, thank you very much. No worries, mate. Congratulations. Thank you. He's a stonker. He's huge. Last afternoon, just about to head home in about two hours, have a go at this cat. Go home this afternoon. Um, seen this fella a couple of days ago. Um, got into about 80 yards of him and probably didn't really make a decision on if we were going to shoot him or not. Um, and let him walk at that stage to try and find some new stags. Um, probably didn't quite realise his potential when we were first looking at him. Um, we come out this morning and we're actually watching a doe and a fawn getting chased around by an eagle and we've seen him off in the background. We end up following him up, um, got within probably 100 yards of him very early this morning and um, they got the slip on us and we lost them there for a while and then Aiden spotted them probably about 350 yards out when we we're sort of making our way back to a new route. Um, we got into probably 200 yards and then sat off for two hours waiting for him to stand up. He finally stood up, walked about three steps and then bedded back down again. Um, and then we snuck in a bit closer and probably waited another hour and a half. So we waited probably yeah, a total close to four hours to, to try and get a shot on him. So he finally stood up and the rest is history. So. This is him, very happy. Thanks to Aiden. It's been a great week. Uh, we'll be back up here for sure. Thanks to Buck. It's been awesome, mate. Thanks, mate. Cheers, boys. But I'm back.